video of Kate Twins channel. And today we have a little something. If you are, a, you know, somebody that listens to the news, you must already have known about the um, Amazon rainforest is in big fires of Brazil. Last year we visited the Amazon rainforest of Brazil, of Brazil, Peru, and Colombia for three weeks. So we know a lot about it. We've been on boat tours around the place. We've yeah. seen pink dolphins. It was fun, that's what I wanted to say, but it's super cool. We saw tarantulas that were this big, but the only babies. And we saw gigantic grasshoppers as big as, as a teen big, 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 like a, mm, like a, maybe a teenager's shoe. Yeah. And we also got to see monkeys. Oh my God, that's so adorable. I just want to see like, for hours. I'm like 60 minute trick, like, Ralph, hold the banana. And then they started invading me. Like, we started pulling my hair. Well, my hat fell off, so. And we also got to have a parrot on top of our head. So, look, it's arrived, a little parrot. It's actually to camp. To do 
this. They blocked the way into the rubber reserves, preventing their destruction. They also discussed issues about road paving, cattle ranching, and deforestation, which were killing the Amazon rainforest. <coughs> Chico Mendes believed that relying on rubber tapping alone was not sustainable. Workers needed to collect not only rubber, but other rainforest products like nuts, fruit, oil, and fibers. And they also needed good schools for the children. Because of his work in the rainforest, Chico Mendes won many awards. Wow! In 1988, a man named Darley da Silva bought part of a rubber reserve where relatives of Chico Mendes lived. He did not have any right to buy that land. He tried to drive the family of Chico away so he could keep their land. The rubber tappers set up roadblocks to keep the Silva out. In 1988, Chico Mendes launched a campaign to stop the Silva from logging the area which was now a reserve. Dun dun dun! For this reason, Darling the Silva wanted Chico to die. In 1988, the son of Darling the Silva murdered Chico Mendes. Chico's only 44 years old. <gasps> Chico Mendes' death brought people together around the world to support the protection of the Amazon rainforest. Following his death, the Chico Mendes Extractive Reserve was created to maintain sustainability of resources within the Amazon. The Chico Mendes Extractive Reserve is the largest extractive reserve within the Amazon rainforest, covering nearly one million um, one million hectares of land. The Brazilian government declared Chico Mendes patron of the Brazilian environment. So guys, the Amazon rainforest, we have actually been there. It is teeming with life. Where else can you see pink dolphins? Where else can you see trees as big as a house? Where else can you see poison dart frogs? Where else can you see gigantic tarantulas? Where else can you see take gigantic um sloths, sloths, and gigantic um grasshoppers as, as a size of a teenager's shoe? <gasps> yes. Where else can you see jaguars also free in the wild? All of these will be deaths, and the rainbows will die with it. If it does not survive. So if people keep on burning the trees down, all of humanity will die also. Because you know, um, air comes out of trees. So that means it'll kill the animals, the babies, and, and then be, that means we'll die also because we need air and oxygen. oxygen. Okay guys, so if you want to enjoy more videos, just click to the left or the right wherever the video is to see the Jaguar making a video in Minecraft Jaguar costume. And don't forget for a like on this video, put a subscribe, and yeah, write in the comments what next video you want us to make. So guys, yeah, bye!